two, three. Hey guys, it's Deja and Ivy. Welcome back to our channel. For this week's video, we are going to be trying weird com food combinations that people enjoy. Mm -hmm. uh, for this video, we are going to be trying weird food combinations by Adrian Bailon from the Cheetah Girls. Uh, we're going to be trying out all of them except for one um, of the yeah. weird food combinations that she really likes. And if you guys haven't seen her video, you yeah. guys should definitely go see it. It's crazy. crazy. I can't believe we're going to eat this right now, especially because I'm actually hungry. So this better taste good. Yeah. If it does not, I'm going to be very upset at you, Adrian. Yes. Um, because you're insane if you actually like this food. The entire time mm -hmm. we were watching her video, we said she has to be best actress award goes to her. Mm -hmm. There's no way she actually enjoys this food. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below to our channel. If you're new here, turn on post notifications so you never miss when we post a new video. And let's get right into it. So the first one we're going to be trying is her fried Cheerios food combination. Now this consists of Honey Nut Cheerios and butter. Now she put a whole stick of butter inside of the skillet and then she That's too fried much Cheerios. I only did half a stick of butter because we weren't gonna be frying a whole bunch of Cheerios anyways. But um, yeah, so we're gonna taste this and hopefully it tastes good. She said that she kind of eats it similar to like popcorn, so. It does taste like popcorn. It does. Wow. This one's good. This one tastes like popcorn. It tastes like popcorn, dude. I think that's thanks to the butter. Mm-hmm. Mmm, this is good. This no, it's not lie. good. Okay, so moving on to the next weird food combination that she combined is a quesadilla. Mm -hmm. Now you're probably wondering what's so weird about it. Um, it's the fact that she puts bananas, bananas. in it. So, we're gonna eat this. I mean, I like quesadillas on their own. I actually made the fried Cheerios, the quesadillas, and the next one that we're gonna be trying. My dad made the last one, but um, hopefully I did it right. I don't know. Uh, it has been sitting for just a little bit because we had to uh, make all the other food too, but yay. This looks real good, you guys. Just Can you guys see It this? does not smell good. Can you see that? I don't like that smell. No, that doesn't smell good. Okay. Make sure you get a bite I know, of the banana. I know, I'm getting the banana. Okay. <laughs> really I have a feeling this one I'm not gonna, gonna like. Be, yeah. Okay, here we go. I don't know what type of cheese she used. I just used cheddar, by the way, so hopefully, but here we go. So, um, I don't hate it. I thought I was gonna actually throw up. <laughs> but, um, it's, um, I wouldn't eat it again. Um, definitely not. I mean, it is something like you have to have an acquired taste. taste. But it's not bad. I'm not, not that bad. Mm -hmm. If you like sweet and cheesy stuff, this might be for you. Mm -hmm. Is it for me? No. I do like sweet and cheesy kind of stuff, but this, not my not my style. But it's not that bad. Not no, that bad. Not that bad. So Adrian, I don't know. I guess I'll have to give it to you on this one too. Two out of five stars. Two out of five. Two out of five. So this next one is rice and peanut butter. Now we've heard of people putting rice and ketchup, ketchup, and rice and ketchup isn't that bad. But rice and peanut, peanut butter, We've never heard of people doing that. So hopefully this tastes good. She says um, in some like um, country. Ecuadorian. Ecuadorian. Ecuador. Ecuador. Sorry. Ecuador or something. They do this. So if they eat it, then it must be good. Okay. So cheers. Nope. No. I'm sorry, but no. <laughs> My goodness. I don't know if it's the way that the rice was cooked, but it's no for me. Okay, so I don't mind this one. I'm gonna give her three out of five because so, three out of four, sorry, because so far, 
The fried Cheerios were so good. This is okay. I wouldn't eat this like no. on a daily basis or anything. I wouldn't even eat it this again, is really. Not but okay. it wasn't bad. I didn't think it was bad. Maybe it's the way the rice is cooked and it's very warm. Maybe hers, her rice looked like it was maybe cooked the day before. I don't know, but it's not good to me. I don't like it. I really don't. I didn't think it was bad. I suggest I you guys give this a try because you never know. Yeah. You might just end up liking that one. Give it a try. Okay, so, so we saved the worst for last. Um, now, we love tuna. We absolutely love tuna. I love it. And we're going to be eating a tuna sandwich right after this video. But not the way that she, she eats. eats it. Um, probably not. It just depends on if this tastes it's good or not. I don't think it's going to taste good. To be honest, I'm, I'm, I'm like so scared. But uh, um, the only thing I'm excited about is the fact that she eats her tuna sandwich on Hawaiian bread. bread? And, and we found yeah. some at our store. I was so happy because Hawaiian bread is sweet. So I like the fact that she eats it on this type of bread. But so, we're not excited at the fact that um, <clears throat> she adds Hawaiian punch to her tuna. tuna. I've never heard of anyone doing that before. Her. Um, so this is going to be very interesting and not only does she just add Hawaiian punch to her if tuna, she feels like she'll dip her entire her tuna sandwich, sandwich into the fruit punch, which we're going to have to try because we're going to do it exactly she does like that when she's tr showing her uh, co-stars, you know, they're, they're all, we're going to eat it exactly like her, like her. So this tuna is so good. I tasted it earlier because my dad, you know, he made it to, for the video. It tastes so so good and I want to eat it so bad but I can't right now we have to eat it the way she eats it so we're gonna share split a tuna sandwich Which, right now but we're gonna first do it how she does so there's our tuna in here it's just a regular thing of tuna and we're gonna pour in some tuna in here and I think that's good and now we're gonna pour in the Hawaiian punch and I know you guys can't really see this but We'll just try our best to show we'll you guys. We'll make sure we show you. How much do you think she pours in? Quite a bit, actually. We'll do that much. Oh, ew! That looks like Pepto Bismol! Oh. oh my gosh, no. I feel like I'm gonna freaking throw up already and we haven't even had, mm-mm. Okay, you know what? Yeah, the smell. Oh exactly! That's what I'm saying! Okay, you add it to the sandwich. Okay, you guys. I feel like we should put more because hers was like pink. Like her tuna. Well, we're gonna dip it. Yeah, we're gonna dip it away. So oh it'll get the fruit punch. Like, Do you think this no... is gonna end up ruining tuna sandwiches for us forever? One, two, three. Our can't taste it that much. The Hawaiian sea bread is good though. Mm hmm Mind you guys, she dips it. Oh my gosh. Oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> Ew! I really hurry up, please, please. But I think oh. it's so okay, okay. Oh my god. Okay, big bite. Huge bite. Huge bite. Huge bite. One, two, three. And then the juice literally, like, as you bite into the bread, it just, just squeezes, squeezes in your mouth. Squeezes in your mouth. I'm sorry, but no, nope. no, 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 no. Adrian, you're, you're a crazy. liar. You're crazy <laughs> and a liar. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a big thumbs up, mainly because we had to eat all of these disgusting food combinations. And the only good one that I think came out of this was maybe I thought if I didn't have popcorn, 
the Cheerios. That was so good. Like that is popcorn on a budget right there. That mm -hmm. is so good. Popcorn in the gutter. <laughs> popcorn in the gutter. <laughs> Subscribe down below to our channel if you guys are new here. We very much appreciate mm -hmm. it. Um, and yeah, on post notifications so you always know when we post a video. Follow us on our social media if you would like to. And we will be doing a live stream this Saturday, Saturday, tomorrow. So if you would like to stop by and join us, just make sure that you look out on our Instagram for the time that we will be going live. We'll and then also, also make sure you are, you have your notifications on because you will be notified as soon as we are about to go live. All right, see you guys later. Bye. Since I'm